So I got this locomotive from my friend, and uh, it needed a little TLC. First thing I did was I glued the windows back in on the cab, um, but it became pretty clear that there was a hairline crack in the drivetrain and that it wasn't going to work properly. So as you do, you start measuring and uh, 3D printing a couple of revisions of a um, design, and you try and try again. and get something that seems like it's going to work. In this case, it didn't because I couldn't get it to rotate because the clip holds it too closely. So another revision. And it did this to me. And so a couple more revisions this afternoon. And now I've got, you know, several revisions going on with this thing. But I am pretty happy with how it's starting to work. So I take it out on the test track and here's how it went. So it's currently in 128 step mode and I put a TCS decoder in it just because the Bachman one was kind of running like garbage. This is the original Bachman one. Uh, and all it does is the headlights and the motor power. Um, but uh, I'm really excited about the slow performance that I get out of this now. Here's one step. Let me see if I can put this phone somewhere good. Like, I wasn't getting anything like that out of the Bachman decoder. So it's in 128 step, 